guys, girls, and non binary pals. Afternoon, good afternoon, good afternoon, everyone. It's absolutely fantastic to see you all here. What a great turnout! And I really hope that those that have the power to sort this out are watching and seeing the strength of sentiment here and knowing that we represent and we're going to be very uh, literally moving out there to the voices of um, incarcerated women. So, throughout the United Kingdom, women's prisons are currently run as mixed sex facilities because male prisoners who claim to be women are housed in the female state alongside women. The Ministry of Justice <laughs> says that to keep all these male prisoners who will claim to be women, says that to keep them, men, out of women's prisons would imp impermissibly deny them their human rights. <laughs> Shame. Thank you. 
places they use or with whom they share them. Women who, like all women, have the right to single sex provision for reasons of dignity, privacy, and safety. And again, in that case, women do not feel safety in this prison. In that Boston Hall report, a third of the women who were surveyed said that they felt unsafe in that estate. So let's think about their safety before we start indulging these, these men and their fantasies. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. The Ministry of Justice claims that this, their current policy is working well. But that's not what women in prison say, and that's what we're going to hear in a few minutes. Women in prison report sexualised and threatening behaviour, instances of grooming, exhibitionism and assault. They report feeling fear. Uh, they report feeling fear. Unsupported by prison staff who are reluctant to act on their complaints. And again, I think if we just remember those women, those pregnant women who were calling desperately for help, but well, I think we can see that we cannot guarantee that women will be supported and listened to um, when they make complaints about this. Women are told their concerns are transphobic or are instructed that they may not use language to accurately refer to the sex of these men because apparently this misgendering is bullying. 